ready. Uh, what makes me different with every DJ has to have it, but who's reading the crowd, like I said before. I think I read the crowd very, very well. I feel like that's one of my big aspects in DJing, or any DJ has to have. I think I have the eye for it and the ear for it. And just the right music to play at the right time. There's always, you always come back to it, and it might load it up, and it might, your ear might sound good, but to the other people, they might not like it. So you gotta, you just have the eye for it. And I think I have a pretty good eye. Um, yes. Pretty much, like as a DJ, that's pretty much, that's the biggest thing is crowd reading. And if you can read the crowd very, very well, then the DJing should come with ease when you're in the club DJing for hundreds of people. So, um, what would you say to a 10-year-old or a 9-year-old who is in school but dreams of being a DJ? I would say pretty much watch, watch, watch videos. Um, the music probably, I wouldn't say, the in, you can obviously get into music at a better young age, at that, that young of an age, but I would watch videos, um, I wish I started at 10, 9 years old, um, watch videos on just, just DJ, just any type of DJ, um, you can watch scratching, you can watch people that are in the club actually DJing. Um, I would watch and then, that's the good thing about the school I went to. There's some, there's some 10 year olds that are DJing now. And like, we have a couple students back home that, not, not even out of middle school, you know, 10 years, 10 years in middle school, a big difference, but already getting their hands on Turntables, controllers, whatever they want, DJ wise, is probably a lot of options. But start young because you'll have a big turnout in life with DJ. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, where can people find you in Colorado? Um, you can find me on Instagram, just at DJ Nick Rawl. And Nick Rawl is N I C K R A W W. Alright, thank you bro. It's been dope. This is Jimmy, DJ Nick Raw. Thank you.